and welcome to uh, another episode of the Midway Region. Looks like we're on episode 16 here. Uh, it's our amusement park city, and first thing we're going to do this episode is name the city. Uh, I thought of a good pun name. I'm going to call it Funway Park. So, I... I if, if you're not American, you might, might not get the reference. Uh, Fenway Park is a, a very famous baseball field out here, so uh, uh, that's F-E-N, you know, Fenway. And uh, I thought since this was the Funshine Amusement Park, we'd call this, you know, this big parkway thing here, we call this Funway Park. So, you can choose to laugh or not, um, although I, I don't recommend you do, because that just encourages me. So... <laughs> So last time we put in these uh, train track or these uh, not not train um, uh, well, I, I can't think of what to call them street contracts. There we go. And uh, the excellent thing about that is Sims will walk on them, so people will be able to get from place to place. And we're gonna put in some uh, amusement park or some amusement park <laughs> some street car stops as soon as I um, connect the street car up. And I think we, we're going to have enough room right up here. Oh, maybe not. Oh, I, we have to upgrade this. Yes, we don't have enough room for the extensions. That kind of sucks. Um. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think of where I want to put this then. It actually might make a lot of sense just to put it, like, right here. Because it's just a transportation thing, and it'll be out of the way there. And, uh, oh! I'm gonna put my name in, uh, in, uh, er, put my, my stream in the chat room for, uh, if you're a fan of Tom Merritt, I'm always in his chat room at, uh, I believe it's t2t2. or maybe it's Cord Killers IRC. Either way, you know what I mean if you know what I mean. <laughs> Let's see. Thanks, Jackie Hearn. I'm streaming live at twitch.tv slash tinbeck. Oh, yeah. So continue upgrading this, and I think this should be a good way for um, patrons to be able to get, not only from over here because we're going to extend it straight across, um, so they'll be able to walk and, and take the, uh, the um, streetcars, but uh, it'll also ferry people, you know, around this part of the city too some, and I'm going to try to come up with a way to get it to come over here, um, but I, I don't, I want Passengers don't take the ferry or the streetcars, as far as I remember. So, I'm not gonna worry about it. Just gonna do a quick check. To see if, uh, there we go. Stream's running good. All right. Just wanna make sure I'm not dropping any frames or anything. Game a little. Game gets a little weird once in a while when I um, do that. When I alt tab out and alt tab back in real quick. But I fixed it. We can take that straight across there. So then people will be able to walk right down the middle. I mean, and they'll still walk down the sides because they can. But I will also be able to put that there. One is definitely going right here, which means we'll put one about halfway, which is here. We don't need one halfway here right now, but I'll put it anyway. Put this one close to this intersection, that way people will come up from the uh, boat terminal and use it. And we'll put one here. And we'll put one right over here. 
So that way we can kind of connect people with transportation and you know just get them around a little bit easier. Let's see what we got for buses here. We should start zoning some buses in these zones. Put one on each of these. There, probably about there. Mm, might have heard my cat there. Sorry. He talks sometimes too. I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with this area up here. I'm gonna leave it for now because I might eventually end up putting in some services like uh, um, sewage and power and all that stuff, but for now I'm not going to worry about it. Oh. And let's get up to cheetah speed here. So you make 25,000. So we still need to get more... Let's check this here too. Let's see what we're getting for tourists coming into the city. Oh yeah. Not enough ways for low wealth tourists. So I think we should put some more bus stops in. Help get them around the city a little bit better. And maybe even put in our own bus terminal. But we're, let's see, that's covered, that's covered. Oh yeah, let's put the bus stop back here. Actually, let's put one here. And let's put one here. There's one basically there. And then we can put a bus stop right in front of the amusement park. That should help a lot. We can also fit the bus thing right back here. Definitely want more buses in the region. You know what? Let's do that. This is, it'll be our transportation hub, basically, right there. That way I don't feel like I wasted a ton of space. Many deaths. Disaster. Disaster. How many how was there a disaster? So if we got streetcars moving along there. I had to make this a little weird and squiggly just because. <laughs> It, it, there was no other way I could actually connect it to that corner, and I didn't want to make an extra intersection. But I, it actually has to like touch a road for the people to be able to walk on it and use the the, the um, streetcars. But let's see what the population pen. All right, we got six thousand people coming in the city now. That's quite a bit. Yeah, you can see the jump there. The overall. It, this is like 6,000 currently in the city. Um, this is over the day. So we had like 4,000 past few days, or a few months, is 4,000 in, in visiting population. And then boom to 40,000. So we got a lot more people coming in. Uh, this is the other thing I want to check. Got a lot of low wealth jobs. A lot commuting in though too, so I think we're okay for the moment there. Medium wealth, work, I mean, we're doing okay on, on all these. Like, it says we need a lot more than we really do. Yeah, we're doing all right. But how is our education coming, even though we have no education in this city? Uneducated, okay. So they're not commuting to the other cities. So we might have to do something about that. We will see here. I'm hoping that they commute to the other cities because the other the other two cities have tons of room in their um, in their universities. So
Ooh, we made 24,000. We were all, almost made our next upgrade on the amusement park yesterday. How's our transportation coming? 13,000 a day on buses. All right, all right. 8,000 on streetcars. Only about a thousand on trains. I was hoping more because I, I mean I had put in two of them. There's only a thousand riders a day coming in on boats. And three hundred on that. So may end up putting in maglev too, because I think High Wealth will ride Maglev, so may end up doing some cool Maglev tracks depending on what I uh, what I want to do with this high wealth and how I, how I attract people and, and stuff. It just depends on what I decide to do. Let's see here. I think I need to fill in a couple. I'm going to try to fill this in with trees a little bit better. And then I'm going to continue developing this side. Ooh, maybe it is about as full as I can get it with trees. How about down the middle? Yeah, see we need some more in there. We're keeping the population so low in this city, we haven't even had a chance to upgrade our mayor's mansion once. And I'm, I'm, I was thinking about it, and I think I'm going to make these medium density streets, because I don't want any higher than medium density to grow in. So these neighborhoods are all going to be medium density. Because this isn't a high population city. You know, it's basically the people that work here are the ones that are going to run the attractions and stuff. Let's see what kind of room I have over here. medium density. And I don't think I want to actually intersect this road right here. Although maybe I could. Doesn't really matter. I mean, pretty close to this other intersection, but whatever. Zone here. And the zone here. A lot more medium wealth workers. No growing to medium density. Bring our schools back. Yeah, because they were educated. I remember last episode I was talking about that. It's like, oh, they got education? Yeah, see? Some of them are. Okay. So it doesn't work. Excellently, but it does work. And their their happiness is improving anyway. They say there's no shopping. Hmm. You know, I think that I'm gonna make an effort to actually make this uniform, so I'm gonna change this. Keep meaning to uh, get the multiplopper mod from Skystorm. <coughs> it's <laughs> it would be so helpful. It's so many times. Keep forgetting about it though. Now, what do I want to do with this? Do I actually want to connect it? 
I don't think I want to connect that, really. Not there, anyway. You know, we're going to delete this for now. And we're just going to wait and just see what we decide on doing with that back area. There we go. In the meantime, let's check on our cash flow situation. Still losing quite a bit of money. Oh, we need it. Oops. There we go. Set our taxes correctly. Even still, we're, we're losing a bit of money. Specialization is doing pretty good. Transportation is really what's costing the money. <clears throat> so, for now, in an effort to not steal so much money from the other ones. Hey, Dirt Bros. And all of the fish of doom have now appeared. <laughs> well, what, what are fish of doom? Is this some cool new DLC? <laughs> Anyway, we're going to turn off some of this transportation here. Basically cut it in half for now, until we're really using it all. And we'll turn off this one. And, and turn off basically all of these and basically all of these until we need them. A lot of people walking. That's what tourists do. <laughs> So I think on this side, <clears throat> we're going to do gambling. So we'll continue this road out here somewhere and do, do some gambling up this way. Um, and some more co um, commercial that will be... Uh, um, <laughs> place taps. So some more uh, commercial that will be uh, a little bit higher wealth or something. So let's check on this here. Everything's getting picked up there. Hmm, not doing so hot there. Not doing very good there at all. Okay. What disaster could these possibly... Just a fire? I don't know. So we need to put in some services, needless to say. We're still losing a little bit of money, but we should sit, but we should be able to afford our services now. And I'm thinking about putting them, thinking about putting them on this road, but then they're facing the wrong way. I don't want to. I already blocked that off. Hmm. By the way, this intersection is continuing to work rather well. Obviously not 100% as intended without one-way roads, <clears throat> but it is working. I wonder if they would work out here. No, uh, that's pretty far away. And we could put services, we could do them back here. Which would help contribute to this medium wealth. I'm just worried about them getting backed up from, um, you know, from people at like the middle of the day. Because these are going to be, you know, medium density roads. We're going to need, or medium density buildings. Hmm. Well, I'm, I know I can put these here. We're going to do this. Is that 
enough room? I think that's enough room. Because then we can put this here, and then we can put one of these down. Yeah. And then put that on. And we're not going to have any drones produced in this city. So, we're not going to be able to run um, the drone hangers and stuff. But that is okay. Because we'll have other stuff. And let's actually turn most of these off. Until I need them. And then I can put the fire station in over here. Actually, we can put it right up against here. Because, I can go in and bulldoze this. We're not going to need hazmat. We're not going to need regular fire trucks because we're going to have some of these. Again, we'll turn most of them off. I just like to place stuff right away. That way I don't have to take expense later when I want to use it. And especially since I can afford it. And we can always steal more money. <laughs> Put the fire marshal's office in. Uh, three of them. Can we actually get the... Oh, we can put the fourth one back here. That's kind of cool. Let's do that. And nothing will burn down in this city, for sure. But we will turn all but one off. Then police is the only other thing, but we have no crimes yet, so we're all good to go there. And I'm thinking about um, what to do with the middle of this road. I could kind of go against what I always do, and I could actually zone it commercial. We'd have a ton of commercial in this city then. And we don't really have that much demand for it. <laughs> and I could also um, do it high density, or uh, high wealth commercial. That would be kind of cool, straight down, you know, big line of high wealth commercial down the middle. Because we do have a, a demand for that in the region. Oh, that's right, we can actually turn off all the ambulance space because the, the hospital comes with two. Oh, and we'll put this up here, but we'll turn it off. And there's already good transportation right over here uh, to the hospital at the, um, the streetcar stop. So, we're good to go there. You know, it would have been cool to put the airport in here. I wonder if you can put a second one in, because I want to just see where, what it would look like. So it would totally fit, and I could, all, I could get at least three, probably even all four. Uh, things. By things, I mean runways. What if I did that? How does, what does that do to my land value over here? It stays medium in the middle there. How about if I expand this? It's, again, nice to have some money because I can just toy around with this. Yeah, it can only fit three, but I, I would be okay with that. Hello, Rodriguez. Nice to see you. Okay. Now, we could also line this road with some, you know, do, do the tall tree row or 
I'm, I'm definitely going to put trees on, on this, so we, we can do something here. But I kind of like the idea of the airport right in the middle like that. And then we can get rid of this one and just do something. I mean, kind of open up this, this land over here. Let me put some of these passenger terminals on. Yeah, see, that looks really good. And then exit, they, they can exit the airport and just go straight into the city. I mean, they'll have to take a left turn here, but that's okay because we're actually going to put um, streetcars on here. And, and I don't know why I didn't think about this earlier, we'll put streetcars on here. But yeah, we're going to keep this airport. And it gets a sign. Hmm. What do I want to sign? I don't want to work. Turn some of these off. And then we'll bulldoze this one. And in fact, we can bulldoze this whole road. And then we're going to want to put some streetcar stops up here. There we go. Oh, oops, just the stops. I'll pretty much just match them to this side. So I'll put one here, and this one goes about there. Here, and one here. That should work. Yeah, it looks even. And we still have plenty of room down here for town hall stuff. So... I can ride. Now let's check our wealth here. Oh, what's our train problem? Station not connected. What are you talking about? <laughs> so yeah, see, zero tourists waiting to depart, so we don't need to even have those other things on. And pretty much everyone should be able to walk in this city. Because they're all going to ride the bus, or they're all going to take the streetcars. So, on this side... I think we should actually make it our main connection back here to our uh, gambling area. But there should be at least one and probably two connections over here. Seriously, why is it saying... Oh, that one's off. Let's turn that one off. Turn this one off. Yeah, 180 arrivals today. Cool. 200 now. Good. Ah, and these are going up to... How's everyone on happiness? I hate these city buildings. Okay. So now it's time to address this issue. Oh, cool. Woo! Got some medium density coming up. Now it's time to address this issue. 
we need to figure out a way to get some <coughs> excuse me some medium medium wealth along this road and I think we'll start by putting down our tree side our, ro our tree side roads <laughs> roadside trees <laughs> Uh, if you don't know this, so normally when you place these, a bunch of dots go away. If you switch to a different one, a different one of the same roadside trees, you can put it uh, right up next to it. So I like to place one kind as close to itself as I can, and then I'll go and fill in with the other kinds. This is just kind of a lot of tedious clicking, but I'm hoping that it will increase the it, that it will create enough of a barrier that the people will quit bitching about their their land value. Actually, start this one from this side. Little variation. More there. Sorry if you can hear my mouse click so loud. I have a the microphone that I have is on a webcam, so it's rather omnidirectional. Um, one of these days I'll save up for a headset or a, an actual shotgun mic or something. Kind of like a Bluetooth headset, but I'm worried about the sound quality, especially from the microphone. Um, I don't know. I just like the idea of no wires. I mean, I don't even like headphone wires, so. <laughs> there we go. Continue to place trees. We're almost done with the second type, so we only have one more type to go after this. <laughs> it's gonna, like I said, it's a little tedious, a lot of clicking. Kind of reminds me of Diablo in that way. <laughs> and so you can't quite get a perfectly tree lined avenue like this, but you can get close. Sometimes the placement's a little funny too. It'll give you a dot where you can't actually place one. Right there. It says I can place one, but I can't. I gotta move one up. So let's see how that actually looks from the ground level. It actually looks pretty cool. And they all, I mean, they look a little bit closer together than I thought they would, but I, I forgot about the street lamps. That's probably why there's a break in, in where you can place them so you can kind of put that put street lamps. Like that, but it works out pretty well. Cool. So let's see if the what the land value looks like. Nah, not not quite good enough. It did help a little bit though, just not very much. <laughs> um. <laughs> All right. What else can what can we fit in there? So ideally, the problem is that these grow this way. And I don't want to start it down here because then I lose... Well, let's do that. Let's see how far I can take this up. Yeah, let's see. 
Oh, and too far from the main building. Damn. I suppose what I could do here is a little, uh... Service road? See, I don't want to make that intersection like that, though. I liked it better like that. Can I just... Do, do, do they have to be connected to anything? They're just parks. They're just trees. Oh no, it won't fit though. I don't think I'll be able to get it to fit over here like I'm thinking. Oh! Yeah. So if we make that intersection a little bit ugly, we can make the people much more happy. Something like that. And actually... I'm going to take this side out if I can, because I want to, uh, I just want to, to block off this part. And I don't want to, yeah, see there, perfect. Because I don't want to wreck anything from the, uh, town hall, because I need room for that, for that stuff, too. Now, yeah, everybody should be okay with their land value up here. Get schools or we move out, okay. So maybe it is time to put in a school. So I think we're going to do this. Straight out from the corner here. And I can find the middle. Somewhere like that. That'll do. Take this out. Take that. And then reconnect it. And then I think we're going to put the school right back here. So I'm just going to put in an elementary school. I don't know how many how many students do I have here. 238 right now. <laughs> so maybe we'll just put in a high school and be done with it. Like right here, and then put the uh, put the gym like this. High school sign, and then how much room do we start off with? Eight hundred, yeah, plenty. Then we'll expand it as needed. And we can put in the school bus stops too. Sometimes I try to put them close to the regular bus stop, sometimes I put them on opposite sides of the road, it just depends on what I feel like doing. There we go, now all of them can get to school. Let's continue the simulation. This thing just doesn't... How are we not making money on this yet? Hmm. Well, we got some of these increasing density. We'll have school here. I like that we have like no traffic as far as <clears throat> excuse me as far as cars go. You know, very very little. Everybody's walking or riding a bus or something. Build a mega tower. I could. I'm kind of thinking I want to keep the 
I, I don't want any mega towers in this city. Um, I think we're just going to stay with these medium wealth, medium density buildings back in the through the corner here, and rely more on our our ecology and our other cities for for people. Back here, we're going to do gambling though. I just need to figure out how I'm going to get all the people in the, in and out of the city. <laughs> Station not connected. Well, no, it's closed. We got 18,000 people riding the bus. It's very good. There's not so many riding the ferry. Oh. I suppose I'm like in the wrong time of day. Oh, and I think we need to put some commercial right back here. Hmm. That's how we can fit, looks like. Because otherwise it, it gets too small. And we can put another one in and hope something grows in nicely, but I don't think it will. All sorts of people on the bus. Two criminals at large. We have plenty. Um, I don't know. What's our coverage look like here? Yeah. It looks really good, actually. Shut up about the train. I know it's turned off. like another hour here. Actually see good traffic anyway. Lots of tourists. That's partially why I put the bus stop right or the bus station rather right here. I think having this open spot, I don't know if we'll have enough room, but we might be able to fit another streetcar depot in there. Look at that, there's a few workers. Oh, there we go. Now there's some workers coming out here. But the traffic is really smooth. And those are all workers that are commuting from outside the city. All sorts of shoppers walking. That's good. Yeah, see, it's just going to be a small density. Or low density, whatever. Small density. <laughs> now let's see if I can fit another one of these in here. I don't think I actually can. Yeah, I would need to scoot this one over. Which, actually, I can do. Let's pause this. And if we put it up against the corner, yeah, we can totally fit another one. In fact, we can put it there. We should be able to put at least one sign and maybe even both between it. Nope, at least one sign. And in fact, let's move the sign over. And put it out there.
Because we're going to need a lot of streetcars soon. I'm only running half of one station for now. <clears throat> but I'll be able to turn this other station on when it's time. There we go. Turn it off. Now everybody can get around really well. Oh, and we need to put our uh, commuter ship in for this. That's actually what I should have done here. I should put it in here. Hmm. That would be so perfect. But... Maybe I just put it in... Let's see, the commuters, though. So they'll be coming into work over here. Like, I really could just put it next to this, I guess, and we would lose that. Oh. Let's... Let's put it over here, because then we'll put a second um, park and ride. Oh, come on. We're going to put two park and rides right there, I think, if we can. Put one here. Oh, we can't fit one next to it. That's okay, though. I like it at the corner a little bit better. But then we can have our... Um, High wealth commuters coming in. And out, but in for now. There we go. Classrooms full. Oh. We have 248 students. How do we have 800 filling? Should we just go up with the high school? No, nah, let's let's build let's build it on the back here. We must be taking a lot of commuting ones, in. yeah. So we have workers coming in from there. No shoppers coming in yet. Freight coming in from both. And students coming in from both. All sorts of mass transit. <laughs> All right. Seventeen thousand on the bus. I mean, we're still excellent on bus wait times. little slow on wait times here, but I'll wait a little bit, because we did turn them off earlier. So I'll wait, and I'll turn them back on a little bit. Trains are fine. Want a lot more people coming in, but they aren't yet. <laughs> 22,000 yesterday. Why are we not making money here yet? Let's just turn this back on for now. Then we'll get people from both cities, I guess. I don't know. And I want to... <clears throat> I'm going to start doing this section in the next video, but we'll extend this road for now. I don't want it to go like that. Curve away from the coast. And then we'll put, we'll, we'll fill this in in the next video. But it's been about an hour, so I think we're going to call it a video for now. Got a lot of people now entering and exiting the city, so we may have to check up on that uh, when we come back in a little bit. So I, I, I'll stream again in a little while, probably take half hour, hour break here, and then I'll start again. So if you're watching live, tune in then. You can also subscribe to my, uh, my Twitch channel, or follow me on my Twitch channel, I don't know, whatever it's called. And uh, you'll, you'll be notified when I go live. If you uh, want to watch after the fact, I do put everything up on YouTube later on. So uh, you can always catch up on things if you miss an episode. And you can subscribe to my channel there to see when I put new things up there. So I will see everyone in a little while.